Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'm going to be planning in the Erin Condren Daily Petite Planner using the Happy Planner Color Story and Free Spirit Sticker Books. I first reached for my Free Spirit sticker book, but it didn't have a lot of these stickers left in there. And I really didn't want to use the foils in here. So I did come across the Color Story sticker book and I did find these, which were a lifesaver because these are the ones that I was looking for. So this is the theme that I'm going to go with in my Erin Condren Daily Petite Planner. I think it's gonna look great with this color already on here. I didn't want to add a lot of color this week i wanted to keep it neutral and black so i'm glad i did find these ones but the first thing that i did want to do is add my little categories which are morning afternoon and evening and i'm just using my um paper mate flare all right so now we're all set and then what i was thinking about doing first is grabbing one of these flowers that are already cut in half and I'm thinking about putting it all the way to the edge of the page over here and I just wanted to flip that over so I can see exactly where I'm putting it down and it looks like right about there okay perfect I think that's a great starting point and then I was also thinking about adding this dream catcher um, on the bottom right over here. But I wasn't sure if to put it on this side or this side. But I think I'm going to go with this side over here. And right about there. And I was thinking of adding a quote over here. Um, and I think those ones are going to be the only quotes in this one. Um, they may have some over here too, so I'm not sure. Let's look in here really quick. Um, there's just a lot of foil in this sticker book and I didn't want to do all this foil, so... We do have um, a moon child over here, and it is smaller than the one on Color Story, so that's good. That one has a lot of foil. I like foil. I just don't like the way it photographs, and because I do add all of my spreads on Instagram, I don't like the way that looks sometimes. You just have to get it at the right angle in order to do so, and sometimes I just can't find it or it ends up not looking too pretty. So that's why I just tend to stay away from it. But these are the only ones we have to work with. Um, because I think even Wonder Seeker is going to be too big. But let's go ahead and try it anyway. Just love how simple it is. So, so that's not gonna be too bad. So I think I'm just going to go with this one and I want to make sure I'm not covering up too much of the letters. Mm. So maybe right about there. Okay, perfect. And then let's see. I think maybe that's going to be it for this page, but we can always come back to it. And as far as this one, let's see. It did have some of those box stickers, and I'm thinking that maybe one could look cute right down here. So let's see. We have Free Spirit, Wonderless. And let's take a look in here. Let's see what we could find. Um, Don't Stop Dreaming. And it has that um, dream catcher too. These ones are a little bit bluish. So I think we could do this one. And let's see what we could layer it with make today great i think that'll be cute 
that way we cover up this one that's already on the page so it matches our spread better so right there and then this one just up there okay perfect and what else could we add on this page i do like these ones but we already used all the black ones and they do have this one but it's plain it doesn't say anything so let's look for black ones we have that to do so that could look cute maybe if we added maybe like right there um, what else? Happy birthday. And I like this little washi that it has right here. Um, more foil. No black. Okay, so let's go back to that to do. I did like that one. And then this one would be great over here on um, Wednesday. I want to give it a little bit of room so it's not touching the very top. So just like that. And did this one have anything that we could use? Um... Okay, and maybe we could even look over here because there is some black on the other pages. And this book is just falling apart. So, oh, I like this. What a, yeah, so just clear backing for today and to-dos. I may come back to these and add them here at the top. I think that would be great. But let me just look and see. If there was another little header that we could use. Hmm. This get it done. I just don't like that it's striped though. That one's striped as well to do. So. Oh, and these ones say to do today as well. But I think these are bigger for that space. Way too big. So I didn't see anything, but let's just go to the last page and see what we could do here. Maybe we could come back to that page. So I think I wanted to go back in here because I did see this one and it has that dream catcher. And I was thinking of placing this one on Saturday. And even though we're going to cover up that checklist, I think it's a great little touch and something different from what I've been doing lately. And I think this just fits perfectly, actually. It lines up very well with that. So there we go. Oh, I love that. And then let's go back to those flowers these ones right here and I was thinking of maybe adding this one on Friday either in the afternoon or evening so let's see where it would look best maybe just right here in the middle I think that would be the best place for it so I'm just trying to line it up with the page so right there perfect that looks so so good but i do want to trim off just this little bit of the clear backing that it had i was just trying to line up the black edges with the paper so there we go and i think even this one needs to be cut so i do want to do this as well okay perfect so now we're all good and let's see um let's go ahead and go back i think i want to add those up here now that way that is out of the way 
And actually, I think it was in this one. Right here. And let's do today on Friday. Okay, that's going to look really good. It's nice. It's simple. I like that. And then we'll do... Let's do to do on Thursday, and then we can do a today on Wednesday. That way it just alternates. So today, and then Monday and Tuesday. Perfect, so we had just enough. That's always great. Right today and then the to do on Tuesday. So glad that I came across these. These are perfect for up here. Okay, so now let's decorate a little bit more now that we have what I basically wanted to do. Now everything else would be extra so we could add a few touches here and there and i do like these stars and maybe these ones could go maybe something right over here okay so maybe like that i think that looks really cute and then maybe a an arrow. Let's try the arrow right down here, actually. Okay, and now let's flip the page. And what else could we add here? Um, let's add these stars now on Wednesday, and then we could add the arrow on Thursday. So maybe something right down here. Okay, so just like that, just a little bit of touches here and there. I don't like taking up a lot of room. Okay, so that's looking great. I added just those few little touches. Now, what about here? Let's put this arrow on Sunday. So just like that. And then maybe another little quote here. What about this free spirit one? Because this one has the stars already. Oh my goodness, why can I not grab this sticker? They've been so difficult to take out lately. I don't know why, but there we go. Now I have it. And I think that's going to be perfect just over here. There we go. That looks so, so good. And I don't think there was anything else that I wanted to add. Um, let's take one more look on the actual Free Spirit sticker book. Oh, and they did have these ones, but I think I like the clear ones better. It looks so good. And they do have some of these bullet points, but they're not black. No. They do have these black stars. Could I put these anywhere? Hmm. No. Actually, I think it looks pretty well. So I think I'm all done. As always, I just love how simple this planner can be. All I need are a few little stickers here and there, and it just completes the spread. And then I'll go ahead and go in with my pen, add my own bullet points, and just list away. Like, that's all I need. A few decorations and then my own bullet points for what needs to get done for that day. But it has been working out for me so well and I am just loving this system and how easy it is. So if you like this video, please consider subscribing and don't forget to check me over on Instagram at Stephanie Happily Plans. And I'll see you next time.